You know it doesn't take much snow to impact the more rural school districts. We've seen that this winter. This year's harsh winter is creating issues for a number of school districts, particularly in northern Kentucky. Local 12 meteorologist Scott Dimmick's been talking with school officials today. He joins us live from Bracken County. Scott. Hi, Kent. Bracken County schools canceled school for the 18th time this season today. And originally, when they first created the calendar, the thinking was that the last day of school would be on May 14th. That has now been pushed back to June 3rd, and that's not a final date. Superintendent Jeff Ellick says it has been challenging to adjust the academic calendar and also keep students in the classroom. This morning, we were at about 2.30 this morning, uh, checking roads, checking turnarounds, talking with the, the county road officials, talking with the state road officials. Um, you know, and it's tough um, when you when you got teachers um, who uh, you know who enjoy coming to work, and and you got kids. You want to keep that consistency going every day. Kentucky law requires that students spend 170 days in the classroom and roughly 1,060 hours getting instructional time from a teacher. But it's not just a teacher thing. They also have to make sure that teachers spend 187 days giving instruction or spending time working on classroom work. Reporting live from Bracken County High School, I'm meteorologist Scott Dimmick, Local 12 News. All right, thank you, Scott. And Bracken County schools have also been on delay five times since the start of the school year. Uh, Kentucky schools are required to be in session for more than 10,000 hours each year.